Hello Taurus, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from thetarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. You are relaxed and ready for your tarot reading. Okay, let's continue. I've had to pause the video because I received a phone call. I've shuffled the tarot cards, laid them out, and we can continue. The first set of tarot cards is showing to me that at this point of time, the individual you are dealing with is surrounded by a lot of conflicts. I feel like there could be some difficulties going on in the relationship, and it could be hard for you at this point to really communicate with this person because they are so focused on either fighting or having an argument. I feel like they're just not responsive and receptive at this point. So let's get some clarity. Why are they feeling this way? I see that this person's mind is troubling them at this point. Something is making them feel like they cannot handle a particular situation. They might be reverting to certain behaviors as a result of their inability to solve problems in the situation. So sometimes people, they use conflict as a form of a defense mechanism to protect them from further pain. So they lash out instead of trying to solve the real problem at hand. Now, I feel like this individual is going through a period of time where they feel defeated. The reason why is because some of the questions they have is not getting answered. I feel like this person has been searching inside of their soul for an understanding of what is going on between the two of you. And because they haven't been able to find a solution, it has caused them to lash out or to have a lot of this tension that was building up inside of them explode outwards. So if you're going through a period of time where the person you're dealing with it's difficult to communicate with. Perhaps they could be a little bit in a very bad mood, actually. You know, so I feel like in that light, you have to understand that something deeper is going on in terms of this person and you shouldn't blame yourself. Now, these tarot cards, for example, is showing to me that you love and care about this person very, very much. If you hear any noise in the background, it's my cat eating. So going back to the tarot cards. 
this tarot card is indicating to me that you feel a deep attraction towards this person and I feel like you enjoy communicating to them. What I'm also sensing is that you could be watching them very carefully at this point, trying to figure out what's really going on because you're curious. The person you care about very deeply has been affected by something and they're not really who they were when the two of you met. I see that you want to move forward in this situation. I'm also seeing that you want commitment, you want stability, you want something that is solid, you want a relationship that's going to provide you with that love and happiness in your life. And I feel like at this point of time, the individual you're dealing with isn't able to provide you with that stability because of their own inner battles and wars that is going on within them. Now, for example, these tarot cards are showing you what's going on in terms of their mind and I feel like they are back and forth, they're not quite sure what they want. But I do sense that they are inspired to start something with you. Let's find out more. So it's coming down to thinking about the conflict and trying to get out of it. Thinking about what the two of you said and done in a particular situation and wondering if they can romance you or perhaps show you affection. You know, wondering if the paradigm can be shifted from one of conflict to that of love, care and affection. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these tarot cards on the Elite Tarot Society as well as the single extended reading. You can find the links in the description box below and if you like a personal reading you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.